Tech Syndicate is live. So head on over to techsyndicate.com. There it is. And check it out. Let me know what you think. Um, also, uh, the website, there's a lot of things to be done. Uh, I'm not going to use the word beta because everyone uses the word beta. It's like beta is an excuse to never finish anything. Uh, of course, we'll always be adding things to the site, but um, but yeah, this is it's not beta. So uh, let me show you how this works. When you first get there, several different categories here. We have articles. Oh, the caching isn't on. There we go. I'll turn caching back on in a minute. It'll filter your articles, videos. Click on that. And blam, that's all the videos. Or you can just look at everything right there. Have our featured articles on the top here. And um, I know a couple guys have already been uh, requesting this. So we added this on the top here. Dark and light themes. Way up in the top corner, small font. Uh, I personally like the dark theme better. It's, it, you know, I like the contrast, easier on the eyes, but a lot of people like the light theme, so we have that as well. Now, the first thing you're going to want to do when you get here, other than go to the feed, which has everything on the website in one concise list, first thing you're going to want to do is either log in and register. If you're a member of Raise the World, your login will work. If not, go ahead and register. So let's go through that process. Let's put it back on the light theme, just so that's the way it's going to look for most people. Now, when you first register, fill out this information, the bio, uh, should be short. Doesn't need to be too long. Uh, you can make it as long as you want, really, but shorter the better. So very simple. And there's two different things. You can upload a profile header image right here, and that's going to be like a think of a widescreen image. That'll be the header of your profile. It's not your avatar. So you can upload that there. There's a separate place to upload your avatar after you've uh, created your account. So if you already have an account, let me go ahead and log in here. Um, work. So there we go. This internet is really slow here. I'm on uh, college. I'm on a college connection right now. So when you first get here, everything is going to be empty. There won't be a picture here. There won't be an avatar. They'll say your name over here. This is your bio. And you have all this space over here to play with your bio. So it can be that big, you know. So you want to click on edit on your profile. Once you uh, do that, as you can see here, you have different categories. You have your account, computer and gear, general info, and main profile. For the account, very easy. Just go through and fill out whatever you want to here. You can fill in your, some of your gamer tags, time zone. Uh, this is where you can upload your avatar. You can either choose um, something from your computer and upload it, or you can pick one of the silly avatars we have uh, as default here. Author profile, I'm going to remove that actually, so don't worry about that. If you put a check mark here, this will allow people to send you an email from the website. So it'll put a little contact form on your page. Computer and gear, this is important because if you ask a question in the forum, um, someone will be able to click on your avatar, go to your page, and uh, see what gear you have. See uh, a few errors here and there, but just click OK, you'll be fine. We'll take down that error as soon as possible. So here you want to put in your computer gear, computer specs. I have no idea what that is. That's just silly. Your phone, tablet. You need to make a note that we only need one one tablet line. You can comma separate the tablets if you have more than one tablet. If you have a, an Android tablet and an I, iOS tablet. Laptop gear, etc., etc., etc. General info. This is like you know your favorite books and all that kind of thing. Favorite TV shows, God forbid. Websites. Fill all that in if you like. Then your main profile is what's going to go up here on top. Just where you can edit your profile header image. Um, you can have a title when you hover over the profile header image. It'll say, "Hey, just like that." And that's your bio. That's uh, this is most of the stuff you you set up when you first, um, you know, set up the account. So as you can see also up here, we have um, the breadcrumb. Some people are missing it because they're used to it being like inside the content. Set it up at the breadcrumb up here in, in the uh, in the header with the title. So there's the breadcrumb. Uh, different sections here. Um, I'm going to go straight to the forums and the feed. Now the forums, we kind of stuck with the same style Raise the World had. Everything being a list. So when you get there, Everything is a ginormous list, except this list goes on forever. If you want to look at the forums in the traditional, I guess, hierarchy, you can click View Forums right here, and that'll bring that up. So there's all the forums. Also, when you're logged in, you have this, so you can click on your profile or add a new post very easily. Uh, one more thing, when you're back on the active forum page here, you'll see unanswered topics, new and updated topics. Now, this new and updated topics is specific to you. We wanted to help you, um, you know, sometimes when you come back, 
you don't know what's been going on while you're gone. Well, this is just a list of all the topics that you have not seen yet or all the replies that you have not seen yet. So when you click on that, it'll be just for you. Over here, you can, um, you can filter the list based on all the different forms that we have set up. So say you only want to see things in general discussion. And then you can even add a keyword in here for search. So you want to filter by general discussion and then you only want to see stuff that is, um, let's see, how about uh, uh, GPU? Sure. So you filter that. There won't be too many, but we'll see what we can come up with here. There we go. Best GPU for $200 or less, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. GPU for questions, GPU fan speed. So it should be very easy to use. Again, here's, here it is in dark. I do prefer the dark. Oh, that's not filled out either. Um, anything else you need to see on the website? Um, the first thing you, be, you should do is head over, introduce yourself, say hello. We have a contest coming up on Facebook uh, because unfortunately Facebook does control, uh, kind of control the world. And uh, we want to be able to do this as a full-time job. And I've discovered that if we have 100,000 fans on Facebook, well, people will just send us money and just be like, hey, you've got a lot of fans on Facebook. Here's tons of sponsorship money. So what we're going to do is um, we're going to do a binary contest. I believe we're going to start at uh, 256. So when we two, hit 256, users on um, on Facebook, we're going to hide an Easter egg on the website. And then the first person that finds that Easter egg and posts it on Facebook is going to win a gaming mouse. After that, all the way up until we get over 100,000, I'm not sure what the first binary, uh, we've got to do some binary multiplication here, but it's going to be a binary contest. I'll announce that soon. But after we get over 100,000, we're going to give away a ridiculous gaming rig. And who knows, if we hit a million, I'll give away a car or something. I'm not, I'm not joking. So tell your friends to, to join us on, on Facebook. That's uh, facebook.com forward slash tech syndicate, or just go to techsyndicate.com. Uh, I was nice enough to put the Facebook link right here on the website because that's what you do. And uh, you know what? If you don't like tech syndicate and you're and this is boring you, then then don't be our friend on Facebook. We really don't want you know people who don't belong. So yeah. Anyway, um, that's the website. It's working just fine. Again, raise the world members. Uh, your accounts are the same as they are on Raise the World. So no need to create a new account. Enjoy the website. Uh, feel free to ask questions. Uh, do so in the forum. And uh, let me know what you think. We are, we are constantly improving and uh, updating. And we'll take care of all the bugs as soon as possible. So uh, I'll see you guys next time.